Hey guys, D-Mike here, hello and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Odyssey. Last time, we started our revisit of all the kingdoms, beginning with the very first, the Cap Kingdom. As you can see, Mario is taking a snooze, and this little critter is showing Mario that it knows best. So anyway, today, we're going to do a fair amount more of the Cap Kingdom, and... Then we'll be ready to call this one a do. If you like this type of content, of course, continue to like the video, comment, and subscribe. And uh, yeah, let's get started. One of the things that I wanted to show that I haven't, I don't think I've shown it, period, in this entire run through. Um, if you hit minus on your pro controller and then you hit Y, the word lists will pop up. And so I showed this briefly when I was looking at music. So you can look at this, but more importantly, if you're hunting for all of those illustrious power moons, you can check this list and you'll notice that in the original Cap Kingdom, there's only 17 power moons of which I barely got any of them now that I look at it. But uh, they added 14 new ones with the power blocks that you get from completing the game. So. Once you beat the game off, you can come back and get the other 14 if you want. Up to you, of course. This is glowing. I'm assuming this is a moon. Who would have thought? <laughs> it's a very easy one that I completely skipped. So, um, the majority of the moons that I'm going to get today to beat off the rest of this kingdom are almost exclusively in the second half of this area. There's a couple sneaky ones, though. This one especially is sneaky. See that big old full moon right there with all those top hat airships flying around? It's actually a really special one that if you zoom in here, I think. I believe we're looking for something a little unique. Ooh, what is this? Do you see that, viewers? There's a car floating around and of course the moon is the power moon is coming directly from the moon so that's going to be a bit of a trek but yeah that's a, that's another quick one which i feel is really silly i remember that one from my original playthrough and i thought that was very strange but i enjoy it when i say original playthrough i mean back in the day when this one first came out so i believe that the remainder of the moons like i said are going to be adjacent to the end of this bridge going into the top hat tower if i had to guess there's one way up there first is this scarecrow challenge i believe this is like a speed challenge we're gonna have to roll our way or not i forget how to roll Apparently you didn't have to do apparently you didn't have to do it all the way, but that's three quick moons for you. Not too bad. Now you're gonna want to grab this pair of Goomba. All of the remainders are in and around the top hat. So we will be eventually ascending the top of the shaft, but not yet. First. These pair of Goombas weren't here during our original visit to the Cap Kingdom. But they are now. And as such, we can enslave them to carry us around for challenges. This is the Poison Swamp Challenge. The Rolling Poison Waves. Ooh. We're here to collect moon chips. It's not unfamiliar to us. I believe there are... That was close. I believe there's a couple of... Um, there's a couple of challenges like this along the way. As we continue on, oh boy. Run! Or fly, I guess we're not really running. Oh, it's up here. There's gotta be something back there, though. They wouldn't put that in there without. Yeah, game, I'm on to you. Alright, alright. Yeah. We're gonna have to dip our toes in the goo! Ooh. That that absolutely looks like the Ivan Ooze slime from the Power Rangers movie. I'm dating myself. Alright. So, clearly. There are hat coins, which if you're into that, as you know, your boy doesn't care. Where's the other? 
That can't be the only thing in this, right? Is there anything behind us? Always look behind yourself. Yeah, that's what I thought. Always look behind, viewers. If you're not ahead, you're behind. So we'll come back for that moon here in a moment. Sometimes when they do these little bonus moons, I'm not sure if I'm the one who is going for the bonus or if this is the original. Usually it tells you. What does this say? Slipping through the poison tide. Okay, so I'm assuming that's probably the bonus. And then the official one, trying to mo is right here. Nice slow ascent. Okay. I think that's it. This should get us out of the challenge itself. Nice. So that was pretty quick. Making much better time now than we did last time because I was being a big old goof. But I'm feeling pretty good about this. A lot of these... Or maybe these Goombas were here. I don't know. Like, my memory is so hazy. I looked at this Let's Play and I started this like eight months ago. I do not remember pretty much anything, so... Gotta case the old Heimers. But anyway, onward and upward. Let's go ahead and grab one of our frog friends. Got to experiment a little bit with the frogs last time. Very fun. Probably one of my favorite captures. Anything that can kind of defy gravity a little bit, which makes the frogs on the moon probably one of the best places to experiment if you're into that. It'd be a great name for like a math core band, Frogs on the Moon. We're going to go ahead and make our sent all the way to the top. Oops. And I think there might be... I don't know if there's an opportunity to do where the bonuses are. I think this is also... Is this just a regular power heart? No, this is a bonus heart. Okay. Ooh. Having trouble navigating the door. Jeez. I'm losing my mind. Alright. So I would have to imagine... There probably is a challenge of some sort. Yep, it's over here. I don't think we did this last time. Ooh, wait a second before we do that. What's up, bro? Bro, bro, bra, bruv. Can't stand that. All right, the roving racers. We do. I do want to race you, bro. So the goal, there's a bacon at the goal. And as you'll notice, the goal itself is the mound next to where the Odyssey is. So, of course, I'm a big fan of those large mounds. Whee! Okay. So the first thing you're going to want to do, as soon as you can, because trying to do this... <laughs> trying to do this just as Mario is actually uh, physically impossible. They will always beat you. So, we're going to cheat, as we did last time. And we are going to fly there. Whee! So, this is the most direct path to get there, and uh, I'm going to shake my pro controller and make my voice sound all weird. Yeah, this is pretty much the only way to do this that I'm aware of. I mean, if you're feeling spicy, you could try to speed run it using like tips and tricks and stuff, but I don't have any time for that. Ha <laughs> ha got him. So yeah, that was a pretty easy one. Not too bad, right? Boom, ba -doom, boom, 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 boom. Wow, blazing fast, bro. Super cool. Yeah, we're going to try to do most of these moons today. I, I don't know how successful I'll be in trying to get the whole thing done. Although I do know that there is a... There is a moon that's directly underneath the brim of the hat. Oh, you're welcome. Give me up there. All right. I think there is. Yeah, this is a, this is a, kind of in the vein. Uh, this is another um, bonus. I feel like like I did. Did I do this? What is this one? Hold on. I feel like I yeah. There's some of these that I feel like I did do, and then there's others that I didn't. And this is probably one of them that I did not, because I don't remember this. Um. Yeah, this is a kind of. This is a puzzle in the same vein as like maybe Mario 3D Land, 3D World, and uh, oh. oh no. Well, that's gonna be fun.
Okay, are we having fun yet, viewers? Get used to this. I hope this doesn't eat up too much of this episode, because I felt pretty happy about the amount of moons that I've already successfully collected. And once again, we're only trying to get like, I don't know, 25-ish, 20 piece. Alright. And we want to let those bricks fully come out of their shell. Alright, that is not what I'm trying to do. I'm blaming this on the game. My inputs have been perfect. So I love this like little uh like the design of the of the ground that Mario's kinda walking on. Kinda makes me think that he's like walking in orange juice. Do you like orange juice viewers? I'm not anti orange juice. Although I feel like in general, orange juice is like really tough to drink sometimes just because of how acidic it is. Only really tastes good if you have it after you brush your teeth, of course. I think I just got myself on like a, uh, a watch list. Okay, I'm just trying to keep my eyes peeled. There's got to be a power moon in here somewhere, I know it. They like to tuck them into the bricks sometimes. You probably noticed that when I did my uh, my galaxy run through. Oops. Okay, super cool. Oh, <laughs> that would have been convenient. I also don't know. Once we get done with this, I say the word "win" very tentatively. I know that. We'll be at the top of the tower. I don't think that we have to fight anything. Did we fight the Brutals when we did this first? I don't know. Also the way I spoke. Did we fight the Brutals? I mean, that's how they introduce themselves, so technically I'm not wrong. Alright. It would be really cool if instead of using, like, Mario Sunshine rules, they uh, give you checkpoints. would really appreciate that. Alright. Let's use our big boy vision here. Woo! All right, look on the inside of the blocks. There it is. I knew it. Trying to fool me, game. Not today. All right. So we're gonna use the stairs here. Whoa. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh viewers. No. Okay. Who saved it? I feel like that's like a teeny tiny time save, I guess, because I don't have to go back and do this again. But I'm still doing it. Whatever. The anticipation of this part. Oh boy. Well, <laughs> that's the game punishing me, saying, ah, that's what you get. I felt good about that temporarily, but. I mean, we've gotten like what? Five or six moons so far? That's pretty good. I mean, if the goal is to get like, I don't know. I think last time we got somewhere in the, in the teens. Please go there. Please go there. Okay. Then we're well on our way. I'm feeling good about it. And that's what matters because I'm the one doing this. All right. Once again, the end goal to be able to complete the game. And when I say complete, I mean the D Mike plays version of complete the game. As I mentioned before, I think there are uh, 900 and 99 happy haunts i mean moons and uh if you want to get all of those be my guest be my guest but i won't because that would take forever so i won't do that okay so that is good um i need to get to the top of this tower now like i mentioned let's see What's at the top here? I need to get a pair of Goomba at some point. Would you look at that? It is Captain Toad up at the top of the world. What's going on, homeboy? Captain Toad, my guy. Where's the moon? We can enjoy the moon together, Captain Toad. Captain Toad. Do something more uh, cool than this for not the thumbnail, Captain Toad. What if we talk? 
I don't blame you. You wanted to see the moon up close? Good call. He's gonna give us a freebie! Hooray! I might still use that. Alright, so that's pretty much it for the top hat tower. Look at the list. You almost saw the original ones. I think there's 17 original ones, maybe ish. Um, one of which we will come back to, but. I need to get a pair of Goomba up here. I don't know if they exist up here. Or how you're supposed to... Get it. I have no idea. A lot of these moons, though, that you're seeing are the ones that are, like, Paragoomba related. Uh, where was the one? It was under the brim of the head. I saw it. You're welcome. I did all of this for you. All right. Can I get that just from jumping? That looks pretty close to, like... Oh boy. Eh. I don't want to climb all the way back up here. Okay. <laughs> uh, we're going to skip that one. As you can tell, I am uh, not about to go do that. That was all kinds of stupid, but I did my best. All right. So we did have that one that was called the Forgotten Treasure. That was the one that uh, the bird told us about. So let's figure out how we're going to do that one. Let's see. I don't know who we talked to for that one. Not you guys. It's Peach where I got her. Alright. You're the only one that's not saying anything, so maybe you. Can you help us? Um, excuse you. Ooh, okay. Looks like this triggers the side quest. Okay. Um. Wooden crates? These? I don't know. Cappy? Are you hiding contraband? Narrow pathway that dips into the fog? What? Cappy, what are you talking about? I am very confused right now. So what you're talking about? I'm thoroughly lost right now. There's only so many crates. And you're driving me crazy. With all these clues. Back here, maybe? I don't even know what I'm doing. This? Um. Uh, well, uh. I feel like I. Uh, I thought that was it, but maybe not. I'm running out of things to smash. I'm punishing Cappy for this. I'm giving him a concussion for not giving me clear clues. He's like he's having a good time. Oh. <laughs> it's the government run. All right. Um. I honestly don't know where else. Cappy, what are you referring to? I am thoroughly confused. What are you talking about? Okay. This is a very captivating part of this video. Thanks, Cappy. Captivating. That was not meant to be a pun. But it was great, and you're welcome. It's very capricious of me. All right. Behind here, Cappy. Potentially. Does any of this ring a bell? It's on 
the tip of your brim. I don't know. Okay. Is there a way to, uh, to cheese this? I'm thoroughly confused where I'm supposed to be getting this. Hey Peach, any help here? Hmm. I might just <laughs> I might just skip this because I'm getting really confused. What is that up there? Oh, that's another one of the moons. It's like, what is that? Doesn't the moonlight put you at ease, viewers? Yeah, Cappy, I had enough of you. We already caught the rabbit. I just wanted a pair of Goomba. Need one of those real quick. I feel like we can probably get more moons just flapping around and listen to Cappy with its forgotten treasures. Ooh, almost missed that. Come here, I need you. All right. I think the game kind of like prioritizes the remainder of the moons just kind of being hidden. Can I do this one? Cannot tell? Maybe? Still can't tell? Okay, I did. It's the one downside to this is I have no idea. I mean, I feel pretty accomplished with what I have done here. Obviously, I would like to do more. I don't know what else I'm missing. Probably a lot, if I had to guess. Yeah, I mean, it's not great. I would imagine some of it's probably those, um... Uh... Probably those, uh, the Koopa that wants to race. What is this all the way out here? Do we get anything for exploring, potentially? Trying to make this final Cap Kingdom video enjoyable. If I get too close to this, will I die? Woo. It looks like it. Is there anything else? Whoa, what is that? Oh, those are just more of the boats. Ships. Airships. Ooh, wait. I see a sparkle sparkle. Is that a moon I already have? Looks like it. Hold on. Yes. Why would it? Oh, no, it isn't. I thought I was already done. Well, oops. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I did not mean to do that. That's how many how many's left? Apologize for keeping checking on this. Well, there's like a handful left. I feel like one's probably going to that Goomba. I really wish... It talks about there's some crates. Is that a... Is that a glowing bird? Are we still on pace to... Get the hidden treasure? Or did I already ruin it because I went and got another moon? I saw that glowing bird just now. You saw that too, viewers, didn't you? That's gotta be a... It's gotta be a moon if I had to guess. And my question though is... Does it come back? Maybe come back? I don't, oh, there it is. I don't wanna chase this thing all around, but I also would like to have it. Whee! Oops. No, I forgot. This is not the one that I can get that way. I'm gonna have to long jump off this. Parkour, parkour. All right, I need your help. All right, where'd that bird go? I feel like if I just go over this way and then I wait, if 
I bide my- there he is. I see you, baby. Mm -mm. Wait. I'm gonna wait over here. I don't understand what the... Okay. So it does- it does make a round. Eventually, it does a roundabout. Comes here. I don't know when, though. Oh, there he is. Oh, I'm on to you. Come here. Haha, -ha, I got you. Stealing your family heirlooms. All right. I do kind of feel bad that I'm not going to get that. Or I'm not trying to get the moon that was underneath the hat. Maybe we finish the episode with that just because I... Feeling a little remorseful. Just a little bit. Wait, 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 wait. What is this? Take picture of hint art. Okay. That looks like something that's on the moon. If I had to guess, that's probably a little puzzle for later. I think that that's what that is. I'm not 100% sure. Alright. So, I'm gonna do... Oops. <laughs> I'm gonna... I'm gonna use my, my last bit of time in this episode. I'm gonna go up and get that dumb brim hat moon. I would feel bad if I didn't. Like I said before, um, I think some of the moons that you can get here are related to the Koopas. So if you want to race, then you can do that. Okay, we're gonna run through here. Those Goombas being assorted in that triangle kind of make me think of those little like triangle peg puzzles where you have to try to hop one peg over the other and then you pull it out. They're like golf tees or something like that. Okay, that didn't take as long as I would have thought. Now I don't feel as bad. Oop, there it is. Alright, second time's a charm. I'll line myself up with it. It would be really messed up if it was, like, really, um... <laughs> of course that happened. That is, that is really frustrating. Alright, one more try. This would not be a D-Mike Plays run through without something along those lines happening. Alright. Bring it right back up there. It didn't take that long anyway. Everybody knows that frogs can swim. Frogs are the ones that are akin to the water. Toads are the ones that love the land. Are you a toad or are you a frog, viewers? I'm super nervous. Alright. If I don't get it now, I am just gonna officially give up. I feel like I need to jump before because that, like it makes Mario a little floaty. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, viewers. Uh, yeah. So that's that's it. That not, that's that was my last try, and that's all you're gonna get out of me today. Uh, but next time we'll move on. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D Mike. This has been Super Mario Odyssey, and next time I'll catch you at the Cascade Kingdom. Thanks for watching. Bye.